following video provides additional important information when using the iCabby application. It is very important that you complete all bookings by pressing the finished button. If you sign off before completing the job, the system will not know you are free to work when you sign back on. You will have to contact dispatch so that they can clear you manually in order to receive another job. When using the voice channel, it will come through to you like a telephone call. Unknown. Unknown. The PDA will answer automatically. You do not have to press any buttons. The PDA will then use the built-in loudspeaker and microphone so that you can talk to voice. If you cannot hear voice, touch the speaker on the bottom of the screen. You should see a blue bar underneath it. This means the speaker is enabled. If there is no blue line, the speaker is disabled. To end the call, touch the red bar with a picture of a phone on it. This will take you back to the iCabby application. The next section will look at waiting time when on a mileage account. First we're going to look at how to activate waiting time while you're waiting for your passenger. This can be done for either mileage or metered accounts. Touch arrive to send the text back. Next, touch Wait Mins. You'll get a notification to tell you when the waiting time will automatically start. This will be five minutes after the pickup time or five minutes after text back was sent. We've now waited the five minutes and the waiting time has automatically started. When the passenger arrives, touch POB and the waiting time will stop and will be added on to your fare. Notice that the waiting time has reset to zero. This is so that we can identify how long you are waiting for the customer before pickup. Waiting time will start and stop automatically on metered accounts only. You must be stationary for the following procedure to work. In this example, the customer wants the driver to stop and wait for them. The driver must touch wait mins. You will then receive a notification on your PDA alerting you to the fact that you are now on waiting time. You must only use this feature if the customer has asked you to wait or you are on a wait and return. If you try to pull away while the waiting time is still active, a notification will be displayed telling you you must resume your meter. To do this, touch the wait mins again and your meter will then resume. Remember, for immediate bookings, waiting time will start five minutes after the text back and if the booking was pre-booked, the waiting time will start five minutes after the pickup time. The program we use for SatNav is called Waze. The following is an instruction on how to use it. Waze will be available to you when you have a booking on the screen. To use Waze to find your pickup point, first select Option, then Navigation. This will load the Waze application. Next, touch Routes and then select the shortest route. You will then get turn-by-turn -turn instructions on how to get to your pickup point. To return to iCabby, touch the back arrow on the PDA and then shut down. To plot the route from your pickup point to your destination, when you are POB, touch Options and then Navigation to reload the iCabby application. When the application is loaded, touch Routes and then select the shortest route. This time the meter will be displayed in the top corner 
whilst you're using the application. To return to iCabby, touch the meter. You now have the ability to contact the customer directly from your car. To do this, touch and hold the phone number for a couple of seconds. This will enable your telephone. You then touch the telephone icon in the bottom of the screen and the customer will be called. Thank you for calling Dragon Taxis. We will now connect you to your fare. Please note that all calls are recorded for training and quality purposes. When you arrive at your pickup point, you must identify yourself as a Dragon Taxis driver. For example, hello, this is driver 996 from Dragon Taxis. To end the call, touch the red bar with the picture of a phone, and then touch the back arrow on the phone itself to take you back to the iCably application. To phone a customer after you've touched arrived, you'll need to touch the details button on your PDA to bring up the customer's phone number. As before, touch the phone number to bring up your telephone and touch the phone icon to start the call. Thank you for calling Dragon Taxis. End the call in the same way by touching the red bar and then touch the meter to return back to the iCabby application. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel as any further updates will be posted on here.